Where the hell am I at? What's that truck say? What's that license plate say? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, damn, I got lost. These are all the same person. I found Okay, so it's 5.15 in the morning after the uh, Lake Ozark show. Let's see, I got to meet Richard and Kim, great people. Um, Robert and Tim, great people. Uh, Gary, uh, Steve, Richard's cousin from the Relic Check. Uh, a few other people. Uh, bought a Chesterfield. And it's the wee hours in the morning. Why am I awake? Because I get to hunt with Richard. And we'll see if any of it rubs off because he's the luckiest, most prolific arrowhead hunter I've seen on YouTube um, in person. Yesterday, him and Kim both won awards. Congratulations. Um, Kim's uh, cucumber, I don't know if you want to call it Graham Cave or Dalton, whatever. And Richard for just so much stuff. I mean, goodness, goodness. Uh, I'm here at Lake Ozark, staying in a campy, campy motel that doesn't include toilet paper. Uh, it's a beautiful place. If you guys get a chance to come visit, come visit for sure. All right, wish me luck. I don't think I need it here from the looks of things, but let's see if we can't find some points. Here goes Crazy Richard in his boat. He forgets to mention y'all, he drinks a pint of liquor before he drives that thing. Swerves like a sailor. Uh, got a pretty tip. It's pretty pretty. Give her a second to focus here. She's pink. This is my first time hunting river bottoms. So, wish me luck. I got a broken tail from the last place we stopped at. We're in our third field, we're hitting them for about five or ten minutes and booking off to the next one and yeah hopefully we'll get back with something good or at least uh, some hijinks I haven't pulled it out yet oh oh hey oh, oh doggone it well well there's a, there's more there's there's a full one out here yeah I'm we're gonna find started. a full one we got one find one on the way there you never know it's a little Missing an ear, but still point. Sure. All right, Toad Jim Michelle, we're going to use it and see what happens. I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's a little bird point here that I just picked up. And I found another one. Tip's gone, but it's a point. Well, it might not even be a bird point, it looks like. A little triangle or knife, maybe a drill. <laughs> Pretty thin to be a drill. Sorry for the runny nose. Richard's got me running up and down this river, get on the boat, and it's 20 degrees less. There he is. That's how the professionals do it. Okay, if you look closely, footprint, 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 footprint. Uh, somewhere. Oh, there's a footprint. I'm pointing at the footprint. There's a footprint. Look what's right next to that footprint. Hmm. 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 I don't know if I'm even pointing at him or not. I can't see with my camera clear. But, boy, we don't have nothing like this in Ohio. It's all there. I'm afraid to rub the dirt off too rough. Nice. Richard just found one of these in the last field we're in. I found a broken one now. I got a whole one. My first whole point. Thanks to Tojo and Michelle for the karma. I don't know if you can see it, the necklace is paying off. It's gonna be whole and I'd be ahead. 
It ain't a Thebes. I'll let you do the honors of pulling uh, it out. Oh, I don't know. Come on. I'm not. I'm, Bring us some I'm luck. seeing two ears already. Bring us some luck. Ah, uh, moved too easy. Oh. Let me pull the next one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Boy, he would have been a nice little barrel head. Okay. Well, you know we. Yeah. You know there's arrowheads here. Broken mono. Okay, got one. Looks like a red one here. Ah, tiny tip ding, but it's mostly there. Sorry for getting out of the camera there. Uh, yeah, it's not a scraper. It's broke. It's hoping for a scraper. There's Richard walking in some wheat. A little flake. Looks to me like it's a bird point. Yeah, I'm sure it's a flake bird point. Check out the sniffle was falling in Boston this weekend. Ah, picked up over five inches. That's a record. I don't know if you can see it. That's hail. Ah, I got real cold too. It was in the 60s earlier. Now it's in the 30s. It feels like. Glad it's not my car that got hailed on.